Now in this video we're going to talk about states of matter and that basically means that different matter, which is anything that has mass, can be found in different states. And I'll explain what that means. So matter, in this case, all of these circles are matter or particles and you can see there's three different states of matter you need to know. So the first one, what happens here is if you zoom in, you will see just these particles, these circles, they, all they do is they will vibrate on the spot. So moving tiny bit vibrations, tiny vibrations, but they won't move much. That's what we call a solid. And what one example of a solid would be ice, right? So ice is a solid and there's not much movement, there's a bit of movement, just vibrations on the spot. Now if we add, so for example, heat, what we're going to do is we're going to turn that ice into liquid water. And beforehand in ice, we had only a tiny few, tiny vibrations, where in water, liquid water, what's going to happen is we're going to have these particles move a bit more, sliding from, from uh, place to place. And that's what we call a liquid. So in a liquid, if we zoom in onto liquid, we see sliding from place to place, but still not too much movement, but a bit more movement than in a solid. Whereas if we add even more heat, what's going to happen is in this case, that liquid water is going to turn into a gas. So in a gas, what you're going to have is you're going to have a lot of movement. So in this case, these particles, they move freely, which means they just move from place to place without any restrictions. All right, so what you need to know is that matter, so anything that has a mass, in this case, these water particles, can be found in different states. Right? If we have a very cold condition, water, for example, will be found as ice, which means there's not much movement because it's solid. Whereas if we add some heat to it, what's going to happen is that ice is going to melt and be ch changed into liquid, where we have the actual particles slide past each other. And if we add even more heat, what's going to happen is that water will turn into gas, and then we have these particles moving very quickly and very freely. Right? So remember these three different states of matter, solid, liquid, and gas. Now what you also need to know is that we can simply change the state of matter. Now one example, an obvious example would be if you have a solid, and the example we talked about beforehand, we can turn that solid into a liquid by adding heat. So if we add heat, what we're going to do is we're going to melt. So we're going to have that ice melt to turn into liquid. Whereas if the other way around, if we have a liquid and we take away the heat, we're going to freeze the liquid to turn into solid. Right? So make sure you know that if we have a solid and we melt it, we turn it into liquid. And if we have a liquid and we freeze it, we turn it into solid. Now if we go from a liquid to a gas, the way we can do that is if we add more heat, we will evaporate that actual liquid and turn into a gas. Whereas if we take away the heat from the gas, we can condense it to turn into liquid. So evaporation is turning a liquid into gas and condensation is turning a gas into liquid. Now, one of these isn't too important, which is this one right here, but make sure you also know that we can turn a solid straight into a gas without going into liquid first. So for example, dry ice, can go from a solid straight into gas and that's called sublimation. So make sure you know what all these terms mean, melting, freezing, evaporation, condensation and sublimation. It's basically changing from one state of matter to another. And that's what the process is called, right? So from in solid going into liquid, if it's, we call that melting, but if liquid going into solid, we call that freezing. If going from a liquid to a gas, we call it evaporation. Going from a gas to a liquid, we call it condensation. And going from a solid to a gas, we call that sublimation, right? Just be aware of those terms.